What's up guys and gals, this is Ristus Frogs, and this will be a natty or not for the porn star Johnny Sins. Um, just to make a long video short, um, no, I don't think he's natural. Um, not only because I've read comments that say he's on, t he's, he's admitted to being on TRT, even though I can't find the recording of it, but, um, I guess for this video, since um, a lot of people out there consider if you're on HRT or a TRT dose, you know, there are people out there le that legitimately need those doses just to get back to regular um, testosterone levels. But usually when somebody's on that, that means that at some point in time they took enough steroids and fucked up their hormonal balance and their testosterone enough to the point that they need to go on to TRT or HRT. That's usually what happens. But there are also a lot of men out there that just have bad genetics and have low testosterone. So to basically gauge what this guy is taking, um, I'm going to look at his early photo. But first off, I just have to say... Um, this is a physique that's definitely attainable naturally. I just don't think he's specifically natural. Um, the defenses that people have where they're like, oh, he's a porn star. Why would he take Roy? It's, that's just going to fuck up his career. Come on. Half, half of the guys in these porn videos, you know, half of the white guys, the black guys, the Mexican guys, like a lot of the guys like, are definitely on roids. I mean, it, people act like the minute you take roids, your dick instantly becomes one inch long and your balls shrivel up back inside of you. No, it takes, it takes some amount of time for that to happen, and it depends on how badly you abuse it. If you don't abuse it very badly at all in your life, if you're on TRT or HRT and just maintaining a regular dose, you might never have those side effects. Yeah, I mean, it all depends. If you have higher testosterone, then you're going to have higher estrogen, which is going to fuck with your male organs. That's just how it goes. Even if you take aromatase inhibitors, they'll only work so much. So, let's look at an early early photo of him. This is the only early photo I, I could find of him. And, obviously, you can't really see very much, but I would like you guys to pay attention to his traps. Now, basically, if you can look at an old picture of somebody like uh, Johnny Sins here and look back at their early photo and even see any signs of traps, because a lot of people out there just have little to no traps unless they just start specifically training traps. So um, I'm not sure about how much weightlifting he did in high school or whatever, but being that you can see some traps here, he does have some good genetics. So, you know, could he have attained this body naturally? Sure. But people also have to take into consideration that even when you take steroids, you still have to put in the hard work to be able to get the muscle. You don't just take the steroids and look like Scott Steiner tomorrow. 2,000 Scott Steiner tomorrow. You're still going to have to put in a ton of work. So... For a guy that basically just wants to work out every once in a while, but still wants to look pretty ripped, like here, yeah, he could have taken a little something. Um, so, I would assume that as of right now, if he has admitted to the TRT, then yeah, he's probably on the TRT. And if he's on TRT now, then that's evidence that he abused steroids at one point, enough to the point to fuck up his testosterone balance but there's just no pictures that I see of him where he looks like super freaky so I just honestly don't think that Johnny really puts in very much of the gem I think he's just one of those guys that probably takes something but he already had good genetics from the start so he just doesn't have to really work very hard if he worked super duper hard then he could probably get like way bigger arms, um, a way more ripped chest, and then probably not look like, you know, not even give somebody a second guess of what he's nat if he's natural or not. But 
due to his smaller size here, you know, it, it basically just looks like he's natural, but I'm pretty sure that this guy's not natural. Um, he said he's taking TRT. If that's true, then he's on TRT, and that would mean that he abused steroids sometimes, sometime in the past. So there you go. And if that's not true, that he didn't admit to be on TRT, I still think the guy's on a little bit of something um, just due to the industry that he's in. You know, a lot of, like I had said earlier, a lot of the porn stars that the guys do take steroids. You know why they take steroids? Because they have to be completely naked on camera and be comfortable with their body. And if they take steroids, that's going to make it, they're still going to have to put in the work, but it's going to be a lot less work than somebody who's natural would have to put in. You know, a physique like this natural is attainable, but you're going to have to put in a lot of work. It's going to be less work with steroids, and especially if you have genetics like he had from the start. So, um, that's my opinion. This is Frog's Take It Easy.